Alrighty, quick video walk around in our 2018 Puma 286 RBSS. Uh, this is going to be a fifth wheel with a power landing jack and power corner stabilizers in the back there. Uh, it does have a quick lift in it because uh, my customer that took the trade, sorry, that traded it in, uh, did have a lift in his truck, so he just needed something a little bit more level. Uh, but basically, double over double in the back with a queen bedroom in the front. Um, and this is going to be about uh, 20 feet addition to your truck box uh, super lightweight under 10,000 pounds so you don't need a class one to tow it uh, aluminum exterior with steel frame and you do get a compartment here in the front for storage uh, the buttons for your landing jack sorry it has not been to the shop once again um, your propane tanks you have 130 pound in each side of the unit and we can see here a little bit on the weight so it's 3400 uh kilograms dry weight um let's see if we have it here and their gbwr is 9400 pounds so just shy of that 10,000, which is good dry weight 7400 pounds uh one main slide out so that's going to be a rear leaving slide and you do get some storage under the booth dinette so you do get a u-shaped dinette in this unit and this is just uh access to the under the dinette storage the panels on the exterior are in really good shape you do get an outside shower here so connectivity for cold and hot water city water connection and your black water tank flush your disposal area here for your gray and black water tanks uh, spare tire has never been used and you do get a fully walkable roof with a roof ladder uh, The unit is ultimately going to be a 30 amps unit since it does have one 13,500 BTUs AC and you do get a little outside kitchen as well, which is super neat So you do get an induction uh, stove top there with a little drawer for accessories, um, a sink and a mini fridge in this exterior kitchen. You get a plug there on the left as well, uh, which definitely allows you to plug in some appliances and use them outside like air fryers and such. Um, and you do have your a power stabilizer in the back that complements your power landing jacks. Power on in this unit here, you we do see our hot water tank here is a six gallon quick recovery hot water tank. Uh, the exhaust for your uh, hood range above your stove top, your furnace and the back of your refrigerator there. But now let's take a look into the inside. Coming inside the unit, we do have tons of storage to the right. Your countertop for your kitchen area to the left and your control panels. In your control panel, you do see your button for your power awning and power slides, awnings and lights here, and your hot water heater and your hot water pump. And you do get the tank gauges for your black, gray, and fresh water tanks as well as your battery. In the living area we do see our u-shaped dinette that is where uh, that storage on the other side of the slide out is uh, we do have accordion blinds throughout the unit uh, and two large size windows in the slide out the couch in its bed configuration so it's a jackknife sofa with some overhead storage and then facing our sitting area we do have our kitchen area with a six cubic feet uh, two-way refrigerator mini oven a three burner stove top here and we do have that hood range that i mentioned in a microwave our kitchen sink is going to be a dual sink finish and with a, a really nice sink cover there tons of storage in the units and you do get your drawers for cutlery and such just off of our kitchen countertop do get a kitchen uh, window, which is nice, so it opens halfway and more storage above that for plates and such. TV location here, this can fit up to a 40 inch TV. You do get a sound bar with a DVD reader and then more storage underneath that. This is super useful 
we can use half of this for basically storage for the bunks and half of it as a pantry that would be very very nice partition um, and you do get your double for double bunk beds in the back our washroom is going to be super nice and very tall ceiling so somebody really tall can take a shower in there and that would be more than enough space so you do get a skylight and your shower with a glass shower door medicine cabinetry a sink that's a really good size and uh, storage underneath it and a really nice size for uh, anyone that needs it to change in here Going into the master bedroom in the front, we are going to have space for a queen bed, uh, some storage overhead, uh, hanging closets on the side with a nightstand that does have a plug in each side and on, on that side you do have a USB cable as well. Uh, pocket door is going to be the main door here in the unit and you do get two windows for a nice cross breeze. So your emergency window to the left and a halfway opening window to the right. Um, do get your uh, ceiling vents here for your AC and furnace. So as you can notice, our furnace is going to be ducted through the floor and our AC is going to be ducted through the ceiling. Um, all LED lights and is a really nice uh, modern finish to it as well. If you have any questions on this unit, don't hesitate to ask, but otherwise, thank you for watching.